Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name's Lee and you're watching Infinite Media Reactions. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a Patreon request from Lizzie V. It's called Courtesy Call. It's live from the Untraveled Roads uh, tour and it's Thousand Foot Crutch. These guys remind me so much of the early Linkin Park days, so I'm looking forward to this immensely. Uh, anyway, before we jump into this reaction, if you do actually like my videos, then please consider it and like and subscribe. It supports me, supports the channel, and I appreciate it very, very much. Don't forget to leave the notification bell so you never miss an upload, and the link to this video will be down in the description. Uh, um, so you can watch it by yourself. It's getting very late here. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Courtesy call, thousand foot crunch, live from Untraveled Roads. Hey, yo, here comes a danger up in this club. When we get started, when we ain't no stuff. We gon' turn it out till it gets too hot. Everybody sing, hey, yo. Time to turn it up till we can't no more. Let's get this thing shaking like a disco ball. Okay. This is your last one and a courtesy call. Hey, yo. Here comes the danger up in this club. When we get started, man, we ain't gonna stop. We gon' turn it out till it gets too hot. Every book is sing. Hey, yo. Ugh. And there's that Linkin Park sounding uh, song that I was telling you about. It's like it just sounds like uh, like One Step Closer or Points of Authority or stuff like that. that. That's what these guys do play like Linkin Park. What what everyone says they play like Linkin Park do. Uh, it's brilliant. Or even Don't Stay. It sounds a bit like Don't Stay um, from Meteora. Living, living your life, I think adversities, trials and tribulations of life could hit you, they make you stronger, basically, he embraces it. You can't knock this guy down, that's what he's saying, I think. Fucking awesome, doing well put in the Linkin Park style. The storm that comes my way, when it hits it, shakes me to the core, and makes me stronger than before. It's not a question of our trust, it's we stand with us. Oh! more than a courtesy call i think this is talking about a relationship uh, and he's comparing it to turning it up in the club sort of thing turning the music up cranking it up etc but he's i think he's talking about a relationship in this sense where he's, they're going to go all in sort of thing and not it's not just a courtesy call that's what i think the reference to courtesy call it is within this song what a fucking banger Oh! 
I love, love the melodies within that chorus. I think they're so fucking good in this song. You've put a poll up, haven't you? Favourite reaction tonight? <laughs> hey, defo. I love the melodies within this song. I think they're really, really good. I love the fact that he, he's interacting with the crowd. I love the fucking screaming ability of this guy. I love the sound of this band. That's what I meant to say. Ah, it's play button, man. It's going funny tonight. comes a danger up in this club when we get started and we ain't gonna stop we gon' turn it out till it gets too hot everybody sing hey yo tell them turn it out till we can't no more let's get this thing shaking like a disco ball this is your last one and a courtesy call go hey yo These guys definitely know how to rock out in a concert, don't they? Really, really impressed with that. It's like, to me, like I say, it's like Linkin Park number two. But um, yeah, really enjoyed that. I'm going to check if there's a meaning to this song and to see why they wrote it. Oh, we've got the song facts. Okay. Right, well, the inspiration for this song, um, the Trevor McNevin said, um, is the intro and the initial lyrics and the melody, Hey Yo, Here Comes Danger Up In This Club, was written a few years ago for a possible album, Welcome To The Masquerade, and it never ended up being used. He still loved it and the idea of adding a hint of a club to a hard rock song, so I wrote a song around it and kept the title the same. I love I love strings when they're used tastefully and I think they add an extra layer of dynamics here. It's a very theatric song. I have never heard anything quite like it. So what was the fucking meaning? He just wrote a song around some other lyrics that he had already, so... We'll never know the meaning of the song because he's not put it in the song facts. But one more thing I want to say was an absolute banger. Thanks for that request, Lizzie. Anyway, if you like my videos, then please hit like and subscribe and support me on Patreon or any of the social medias. And the links are in the description. Thanks for watching. I shall see you on the next one.